going on to you Aquarius you have the strength the nine of pentacles and the page of swords so obviously the strength represents Leo yet that's your opposite zodiac sign um so that kind of axis that kind of energy right pulling from the Leo energy um learning how to be a lot more bold courageous um you're getting attention based upon the fact that you know you Aquarius are being bold and courageous and doing your thing uh, not saying that Aquarius is cowardly, but because it's not, but Aquarius sometimes can not necessarily get into confrontation because you take the high road because you understand things from a higher perspective. Um, and you're still that way, but uh, a lot of you are getting the attention for it. The Nine of Pentacles, um, understanding what is important to you what is not important to you. So as a result of understanding what is important and what not is important, right? You basically choosing to not spend your time on useless things, people, ideas, actions. And then you have the page of uh, swords. Um, page of swords, queen of swords, and also not being very worried about if somebody cares about, um, excuse me, not not being worried about if somebody likes every move that you make. Um, there's a sense of you potentially getting some people upset, whether it's on a job, friends, family members, and you Aquarius don't really care because it's like, you're doing this for the greater good. You're doing this, you know why you're doing this. Who cares why it is that they get upset for in the heat of the moment? Yes, they matter, but you have to do what is best, right? And the hangman represents you understand that in time, they'll see things your way. And if not, the very minimum, they will forgive you for it. So there's definitely a sense of you Aquarius being a lot more bold with it. <laughs> you Aquarius caring less about, to a certain extent, about what other people think. And and you're 100% right. I've, I've talked about this literally just yesterday, right? What you're trying to do as an adult is that because you have the mind for it, you have the age, you have the experience, right? When you are a little one, you're helpless. People have to give you things. But when you get older, you're not helpless. So what that means is, I personally, I don't think people really understand what being an adult really actually is. I think that a lot of the times, not, not even most, but just some people think that an adult is just like, they, it means that they can stay up late. I don't really think people really understand what being an adult means. Um, and, you know, sometimes that, that, you know, being an adult means that it, it means that you have to stop being so worried about what other people think of you. I'm just serious. Because adults are too follow fashion. They're too much of follow, too much of followers. Hold on. They're, they're too caught up. Sorry about that. The wind was blowing too hard. But they're too caught up with uh, followership and what I mean when I say that they're too caught up with followership right they're too caught up with followership I'm talking about it from a perspective of like they're too caught up with um, thinking about what other people think of them and all this other stuff and that can end up playing a part in their overall decision making because you Aquarius, like I said before, you don't you're you're learning which is what I've been saying the long for the for the longest time that you know people people say that I'm losing my mind, but it's not even true. What it is 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 that what it is 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 that when you're going to when you're an adult, you have to understand that you're going to not you're going to rub people the wrong way at some point. And that being an adult is about simplifying your status. It's about simplifying your life. It's not about complicating it. It's about making it as simplistic as possible. So 
running around trying to look for validation all the time is overly complicating it because you don't put yourself in a very good position, right? To actually do and say what you want to say and do what you want to do. So why I'm saying that at all in the first place is because of the queen of swords, like I said, in the hangman. You understand that. A lot of you Aquarius understand that. And, you're, and the thing is, is that even though we understand it, some of us, like you Aquarius, sometimes not necessarily always comfortable with it. And I get it. You have a soul, right? You're still going to feel bad at the end of the day. But as long as you understand, even though you feel bad, as long as you understand why it is that you essentially did it for, as long as you're not like being inequitable, you're okay. You should be okay because as long as you're being fair, because at the end of the day, you know why it is that you're rubbing people the wrong way. It's about you, Aquarius, having to learn to look out for yourself. You, Aquarius, have been looking out for yourself in such a long time. Now, all of a sudden that you're looking out for yourself, what people, right, on some Queen of Swords, people have a problem with it. Who cares about them? Right. So the Hierophant and the Four of Cups here represent, and since that's the case, a lot of you Aquarius understand that. A lot of you Aquarius understand that. And you understand that, you know, you have to, you know, <laughs> things aren't as um, clear as a lot of people make it seem. Because what it is is, is that they're trying to put you at the mercy of whatever it is that they want you to do because you don't particularly act a certain kind of way. This is why it is that I talk about moralism because because of the fact that you don't act a particular kind of way around this time and you Aquarius are doing what you need to do for yourself, your family, the people that you're trying to look out for. A lot of people see that there's a real big change in you. Like I said, it could be people at the job friends right you 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 doing stuff to secure stuff for yourself and your family members and or your, or yourself right if you're not necessarily that tight with your family members like that right i do understand that there's different aquarius among them so they've noticed this big change in you and they're trying to figure out four of cups what exactly is going on Right. And the thing is, is that the Queen of Wands represents they're acting sedity with you. Right. Where they're acting brand new because they're trying to figure out what is going on. And they don't seem to understand that you Aquarius are not messing around. This is not an act. This is not you Aquarius looking for attention. You're getting the attention right on some strength card. You're getting the attention based upon the discipline. And the, and the directness of your goals and what you want, the ruthlessness that you're showing. You're being fair, but the way that you go about handling your business is ruthless. It's, it's, it's very straight to the point. You know what it is that you want, professional, cold business. You're not coming out here, you're not coming outside to play. The Eight of Cups and the Four of Swords now is about, and, and because of this, a lot of people don't know how to deal with you because you Aquarius try to engage with people from a, a friendship perspective before you start dropping the knowledge. But now you Aquarius are like, you just don't care. You don't even care. So now, so now what it is that they're ultimately going to do, right? What are they going to do? And the things that the Four of Swords represents, they don't really know how to deal with that. They're not even accustomed... It's it's the it's the it's the the surprise element. They don't even know how to deal with an Aquarius that's about their business. That's strict with their business. That's that's not so strict to the point where it's like you you know you there's no room for creativity, but stays on task, isn't trying to save people, has an understanding, even more of an understanding in mind. This is what you want to do. You know, things turning around or things t still turning for the better. It's like, what do they even do with a person like that? You know, focused. You know, as I've been talking about ghosting, you know, people see you and you may even speak to some people. But your time, time management, how much time you spend hanging out with them is like, oh, okay, cool. What's up? 
Ha, how you doing? Bye. So let's clarify the Eight of Cups. You have the Seven of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, sorry about that, Four of Swords, Tower, and then the Two of Cups. So to clarify the Eight of Cups. So the Seven of Swords, the Ace of, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Four of Swords right here speaks to how a lot of you, a lot of you, uh, a lot of you Aquarius, right? Yeah, you going you you look at it like you going out there and hunting. You doing what you are doing. You're looking to put food on your table. You're not worried about trying to make friends so much like that anymore. The Ace of Pentacles and the Four of Swords, you know, um that puts you in a pack of wolves. That gives you a wolf mentality. You see wolves on the the card literally. I know it's a little bit dark. I wish the cards were a lot lighter. Um, maybe there's a version where they are a lot lighter, but anyway, where you can see it better, but, um, puts you in a, in a wolf type of mentality where, you know, you understand what type of time it is. You understand what you got to do and that, you know, some of you Aquarius are rechanging, you know, you're changing your, your overall look on it. It's not so much of like a personality thing where you got some sort of issue like that. It's much more the mentality, which will change the personality. You're still the same you, but it's jovial, knowing how to get into conversations. You're still you, right? You're not acting brand new. What it is, is, is that the mentality has changed. You understand from personal experience that you did all of that. You, you did try to talk to people and try to, you know what I'm saying, break into friendship mode with them first, and then put the knowledge onto them. And these people are idiots, some of them. They 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 so caught up with goofy stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like I asked somebody if, you know what I'm saying, if they're ever gonna travel and they're talking about what, what is it that you talking about? So you, so you wanna stay in your neighborhood your whole life goofy? You wanna stay? People so caught up with stupidity, they 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 sound like cocotazos, like yo, like you sound slow, like you sound stupid, yo, like. <laughs> so let's clarify the. Uh, hold on a second. You all right? Okay. I thought somebody, I thought somebody that came in through the door. I was not about to be like, all right, I'm okay. Let me go confront the intruder. <laughs> yeah, all right. Anyway, the tower and the uh, the two of cups represents how a lot of you Aquarius, a lot of the wind blowing, a lot of you Aquarius, like I said, you don't have time for that, you know? And it's now... They want to get into conversation, conversations with you. Because, again, they haven't seen you, Aquarius, be about your business on your job, be about your business with, with your acquaintances, right? You, you, you say what's up to your acquaintances. You may have, like, a few sentences with them, if so, that. And then you basically, like, okay, what's up? Oh, excuse me. Okay, bye. Have a good one. That's odd to them because they expect you to kick the knowledge. They expect you to... They expect you to be kicking the knowledge. They expect you to like make problems. They expecting you to start spazzing. They expect you to start being very upset. But when you Aquarius are like, hi, right. <laughs> they're, they're like, <laughs> so that's pretty much it for now. A lot of you Aquarius are about your business. Comment on the video, like the video, subscribe. Peace.